United are a long, long way behind. Well, they've got that sinking feeling once again. Manchester United. United are, are an elite club. You look at the other teams in the Premier League at the moment, they've got elite managers. What they do need is an elite manager. Manchester United's collective misery. It's a way back for Solskjaer now. The scrutiny was intense. The questions loud. The performance woeful. Whilst the players on the pitch unquestionably let down their manager, it was Oli who paid the price. I feel for the fans and I feel with the fans and I'm, I feel the, the same as them. It's uh, We're embarrassed losing uh, the way we do. We know we've been, we are in a, in a very bad run, a bad situation. And then sometimes you've got to say sorry and that was a, a sorry for the uh, performance. How low are you feeling right now? Well, I've... Very, for, to put it that way. Appreciate your time, Ollie. Cheers. Thank you. Thanks, Karen. Morning. Morning. Big smiles. <laughs> I've been here as a player uh, 11 years. I've been as a coach for three and a half years. So it's the best part of 15 years of my life. It feels like old. There's a wind and it's blowing. There's a current that's running deep I can't see but I know it That something's not what it's meant to be I wanna see love make a comeback I wanna feel hope when it runs out I wanna see it The first time they've scored five in the Premier League since the days of Sir Alex Ferguson That's what he can do, it's a stunning goal Just United momentum continues to gather The unbeaten run goes on, it's another win Nine wins in ten games since he took over. They're still in touch in that race for the top four. We're gonna see love make a comeback. We're gonna see love when it runs out. We're gonna see every Rashford! What an incredible turnaround by Manchester United! They were flat out! They were punch drunk! And suddenly they have found the response! But get the contract out, put it on the table, yeah. let him sign it, let him write whatever numbers he wants to put on there, give him what he's done now since he's come in, and let him sign the contract and go. Ollie's at the wheel, man, he's doing it, he's doing his thing. Man United are back. When Ollie arrived, United were a club confused, dazed and disgruntled, shook by the post Mourinho blues. A culture divided, the squad torn at the seams. We come home for the mercenaries theatre, only in our dreams. Oli came in with a goal to rebuild, to create the foundations. Perhaps the theatre can dream again. The goal he fulfilled. Trophies eluded Solskjaer, the cabinet remains empty, but his legacy remains intact, forever our number 20. The end was rough, the pain was real, no United fan will deny that play. The scars are fresh, the wounds aren't healed. The memories, yeah, they still burn bright. From that night in Paris to polishing Pep, Solskjaer certainly had his moments. And for all his flaws, his weaknesses, he installed some key components. Bruno Fernandes! He's a special player! Pogba! Oh, what a finish! He's a real red! This guy will decorate the Premier League! Red letter day! Rockets Manchester United ahead in a flash. There's nothing old Trafford loves more than that. In for Rashford Cavani. He's done it again. Edison Cavani. And that is an absolutely glorious goal from Manchester United. United squad is strong, ready to fight again. And the foundations Ollie laid are steady. Now Ralph Ragnick arrives to take the reins. The Premier League isn't ready. So remember the good times, the memories of Oli at the wheel. I think everyone knows I've given everything for this club. Club 
means everything to me uh, and together we're we're a good match but uh, unfortunately I couldn't uh, get the results uh, that we needed and um, it's time for me to step aside. I remember United at the end of Jose Mourinho and from where we were to where we are now I think Solskjaer has done a great job in creating the foundations, taking us out of the mud. I know the foundation is there, they're ready to, to kick on and uh, uh, I'm sure they will. The fans have been amazing from day one at Cardiff till till the last one now. So he did a lot of good work. He may not have won the trophies, but was he ever going to be the man to take us back to the top? I just think he was always the man to drag us out of the mud, and he did that better than anybody. And he cares. He bleeds for the club. He cares for the club. You saw it in his last. You saw it in his interview at the end that was painful to watch. Becoming emotional now because they top and um, ah, that's um, they'll be they'll be fine. I'll I'll watch them and support them. Solskjaer loves United, and United fans will forever love Solskjaer. Well, it's been brilliant dealing with you. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. See you soon. <laughs>